above, I am just a medical supplier. Um, medical supplies. <laughs> no, that's not the, the above. I am just a medical supplier. Um, I got a feeling that, uh, you know, with all these medical supplies and increased manufacturing and shit that we're short on, they're going to need to get places quick. Hopefully they choose some of us to do that. There's still other stuff that needs to happen that not everybody's shutting down. Who knows how this is going to go. What I really see happening, though, is once we get through this primary stage and we see that the um, bug, if you will, for 80 some odd percent of us is going to be nothing more than the standard yearly bug. Um, and we'll get through it. Excuse me. I had bubbles. And we'll get through it. And we'll move on. We'll carry on with our day. It is going to suck for people that have reduced I'm scared to use a different word because I'm a broke fool and I like making money. So, uh, for those of you with compromised assistance or the elders here, um, it's going to be kind of tough. And I feel for you. And I bubbles today. Um, that's going to be a rough one. And the sad thing is, is that. You know, there's a lot of kids that are younger people or whatever still going out and combobulating with other people and uh, because they hear that the younger people aren't getting that, 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 that compromise. But they still carry it. And then they can give it to those that do get compromised without ever even knowing. And that's really something. For example, if uh, business shut down hard enough and there's nothing for me to do but wait it out. I can't necessarily go home because my wife is living with my father-in-law, who's very old, and he's got compromising stations, compromisations. That's a word, I'm sure. <laughs> and I don't feel anything right now. I feel happy, go lucky, fat, and honored. But I don't know. Maybe that bug is playing around with my ears. And I don't want it to be the responsibility of shutting the old man down. But I can't like it. <laughs> My wife can't like it. His other daughter's whole family can't like it. He's a good dude. And if I go there, and then all of a sudden he gets it, whether it came from me or not, I'm going to think it did. So I ain't going there. Unless I could buckle down for 14 days and get through whatever, then maybe. But how am I going to do that? Living in the van. I mean, I got plenty of supplies. I'm, I'm pretty well hooked up. Y'all know my hat. I'm an old trekker. And I'm hooked up about as well as I can be for my abilities without going home. In other words, my gun safe is still locked up at home. Not at her home, at the storage unit. And I still have some, some goodies, but not my good goodies. <coughs> um, but I got about 10 gallons of water back here. And uh, I got at least a good week and a half of food. Good food, 